I decided to go with the Revolution from Fontaine. Absolutely the best trailer I think you can buy for your money. The weight capacity, the sliding axle, the toolboxes, the aluminum makes it much lighter so you can carry more load. Uh, I'm just so happy with this Fontaine. If you look at our aluminum product, our Revolution, we manufacture a trailer that's a bit different, especially the Revolution trailer uh, with no cross members underneath, totally different than any other trailer manufactured in the industry today. Uh, this is actually a two-part component. There's a chassis that's built, and then there, the, the floor, the one-piece floor, is built separately. And it is uh, considerably more rigid uh, than a traditional floor. So say, for instance, if you've got a full load and you go around a turn, or a traditional trailer will have a bow to it, uh, this, this is much more rigid, stays a lot more uh, straight, tracks true, so you have uh, improved fuel mileage, uh, tire wear is less, that kind of stuff. So we've got a ton of these things out there, so we've got millions of road miles on this. Every trailer, whether it's 48 or 53 feet long, uh, the floor is all starts with 12 inch extrusions, just like you see right here. Uh, and so we cut these to length here. Uh, you know, we have a straightness standard and a twist standard so that these always lay in there perfect so that the friction stir can happen. Uh, the friction stir weld process itself, that welding process is not done by anyone else in this industry. Friction stir welding was in invented over in London by the London Welding Institute. And it takes and heats that aluminum extrusion, that seam, up to about 800 degrees and takes that aluminum and it transitions it to the molecular level and spins it. It doesn't melt it, it spins it and turns it and forges it into a single product, maintaining about 92% of the composite strength of the original aluminum. Yeah, so the screen on the top is coming towards us, the screen on the bottom is, is going away from us. And what friction stir is, it actually takes a router bit and it stirs the material together. So you're not actually welding, you're not actually adding material. You're just taking what's there, and you're taking a router bit and stirring it together. They've been putting wings on airplanes like this forever and ever. It's just a new application of an old technology. So you can see uh, the routed side rail, uh, they're, you know, they're left and the right. They're mirror images of each other. And then they put, they'll be put right up here and there's a groove cut into this part and they fit together. So you have automatic welder there, welding that way. And you'll see down here, there's another one on this side about to weld towards us. They always weld opposite of each other. So you're not putting too much heat in one side. Uh, on the Revolution product, on the 5R trailer, uh, you can see where almost all of your airline is encapsulated in this hat channel. Aluminum is a lot more corrosion resistant, so part of that uh, is, is encapsulating your air and your electrical in the hat channel. And you can see the floor is being built in one direction, the chassis is being built in another direction, and then they'll, they'll marry right here uh, in this next station that we're about to go to. Um, so that one's already got one suspension on it as it's turning. Uh, they're getting ready to set that one down and roll it forward uh, so that they can install the other suspension in the kingpin. Here at Fontaine we, we offer multiple different axles where you can have both of them that slide. They slide together, they slide separately, fixed, fixed forward, fixed backwards. Lots of different uh, options. It just depends on the specific application uh, and the customers are very in tune to what they need. So if we want to do the extra stuff, all that goes on out here with our Fontaine Select Group, like uh, the 5R trailer, and they brought it out here, and what they did was they added the ramps. Um, they added all the special parts of the different things. That all happened out here at Select. A lot of that work happened out here with, with, this, uh, with this team. Well, the new trailer's here. Well, that's neat, oh. What's it look like? Uh, it, it looks, it's amazing, Dad. Of course, it's all aluminum. Yeah, that's what's nice, oh man. And this extrusion rail here is all one piece. The strength on this extrusion oh, rail, boy. and look at this. Oh man, I need, and I used to have to hunt up a place to tie stuff down. This trailer weighs 11,000 pounds. I, I, you know. That's all. Some, some, some of the little pull behind bumper trailers weigh that. This front deck is 11 foot long. Like a Jeep, you can set a Jeep up there real easy. Yeah, a nice Jeep yeah. will go right up in there. Oh man. And then uh, underneath here in these boxes, see these little gadgets here? Yeah. They oh, sit here. Oh man. And then they. Isn't that stuff there? Isn't that something? Oh, I tell you, they've improved stuff so much, it's unbelievable. And it's equipped with ABS brakes, so they won't lock up and turn sideways on you? Yeah. 
like on ice or something, you know. But I mean, look at that trail that goes way down there. It goes into a different time zone at so long. When we get the yeah. truck, I'll get <laughs> your, we'll go get your CDL reenacted and you can, nah, nah, no? Nah, you don't want to go like, on the road would, with me? I would have liked to had this when I was back running them, but right now I'm too old to run them. Well, I can't wait to get it on the road. Oh man, I'd get that tractor under it, it'd be out of this world. Yeah. Yes, sir. It'd be quite a, quite an experience from what we used to have. Well, I gotta go, I gotta go make some money to pay for this trailer, so. Oh gosh almighty, don't <laughs> think of that. <laughs> I'm gonna stop by Fontaine so they can see the trailer in action. I hear they're great people, I can't wait to go there. I decided to swing by Haleyville, Alabama here at Fontaine Trailers to show these guys how it is we plan on using this trailer. And it's just amazing the way this thing works and I just wanted to share it with them. Yeah. 